Now, 1A Division II. Someone's going to Columbia. Will it be Timminsville or Lakeview? The Wild Gators get home cooking in this one. And the Whirlwinds have been on a red hot streak at the best possible time. Josh Hampton causing the fumble. Timminsville is in business. And Tamara Jones is going to go to the air. Jalen Moore, 27 yards. The Whirlwinds strike first. It's 6 0. And they weren't done there after a pick six. Timminsville would turn to Reggie Brown taking the snap. And Brown rolling left. It's 22 0, Timminsville. And so Lakeview. Down three scores. Get something going here. Look at big Kyle Carter. Nice run right there. The drive would cap off when Jeremiah Cribb finds the end zone. And Lakeview is on the board. It's a 22 to eight ball game. Timminsville has had tremendous production from this guy, Ty Kez Young. And Young coming through with a big, big run right here. He is a load to bring down. And here comes Terrence McFadden. McFadden battling. And he gets it just across the plane. He wants the six and he's gonna get it. A touchdown for Terrence McFadden makes it 30 to eight. And the Timminsville defense was opportunistic all night long. Weston Rogers just fighting for yards. He loses the handle right there. Chris Wright is able to fall on it. And then how about another Timminsville turnover? O'Neal McCray comes in with the sack. Tyretius Zimmerman is able to recover. And a tremendous first half for the Whirlwinds is capped off with Tykes Young Rambles 37 yards, and at the half, Timminsville has a 38 to 8 advantage. Third quarter highlights now. You got to give credit to Daryl King's Lakeview team. They didn't give up despite the large deficit. Crib gets his second touchdown of the game, but this was Timminsville's night. Terrence McFadden is going to get his second TD of the game. Fadden had a pick six last week down at Cross, and it was all Timminsville in this one. 56 to 14 is your final. Look at those numbers for Ty Kez Young. 13 carries, 206 yards, and a touchdown. And Bill Tate, who was a longtime coach at Timminsville, he left a few years ago. He came back. This will be his seventh state championship game that he's coaching in. He has two state titles at Timminsville. That's why his name is on the stadium. WPDE's Andrew Prue has more from the victorious whirlwinds at Lakeview High. For the second time in the last three years, the Lakeview Wild Gators have gone head to head with the Timminsville Whirlwinds with a chance to play in the Class 1A Division II State Championship. Now, two years ago, it was the Gators nipping the Whirlwinds 22 to 20, but tonight, after a monstrous performance by Tyquez Young, it is the Whirlwinds going to the state championship, Bill Tate's seventh state title appearance. This is special because the fact that these guys was, was picked to do nothing. You know, you take a team that, that nobody give, give a, uh, would give them a chance to do anything, and, and you know, people wouldn't come to the games and stuff like that. But hey, these guys believe, and as long as they believe, I believe. And they told me, say, Coach, we believe, I believe them, and they believe me, and hey, we, 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 we're here. But the, game, the job's not finished. The job, you know, we're, we're going to the state championship, and we're just not going to make an appearance. We're going to hopefully trying to bring it back home to the PD. It happened for the past two years. We came close in the playoffs, and we can't fell up short, and this time we're trying to finish. Now this coming Thursday, you'll find a lot of families at the dinner table enjoying their Thanksgiving meal, but one family you will not find is this Timminsville Whirlwind team. The Whirlwinds will be on the practice field gearing up as Bill Tate says it is a tradition in Timminsville to practice on Thanksgiving Day as they gear up for their matchup against Hunter Kiner Tyler in Columbia. That game will be played at Benedict College at noon. Reporting for the end zone, Andrew Prude, WPDE Sports.